The Lincoln Fire Protection District has a new engine at their disposal with technologically advanced features and multiple uses. And since Saturday, it's already seen some action. Lincoln's Fire Protection District has its new multi-use fire engine and Lieutenant John Potter says this upgrade is primarily about safety. Over the 20 years that we've had that truck in service, uh, there's been several safety upgrades that DOT and NFPA have come out with that clearly make this a safer truck than something that was on the road 20 years ago. Part of the safety improvements were making the engine more technologically advanced. Now there's a lot of digital features um, including um, you know just a computer screen where the driver can actually operate all functions within just a hands reach um, including the lights off the rear, uh, the generator on top and several different functions. Yeah. That and this engine isn't just used for fire suppression, but multiple emergency services. So it kind of has that blended fire rescue and EMS all in one truck. And we've set it up to where fire's on one side, EMS is in the cab, and rescue's on the other side. So it's very compartmentalized, and we've gained a lot more room with this truck, um, and really going to serve a big purpose for the district. That's the truck was activated Saturday by a ceremonial push-in, and that big purpose Potter mentioned is already being served. Potential semi-fire up on the interstate that luckily the driver was able to put that out before we arrived. Um, there's been uh, several auto accidents, and I believe even an EMS call that it's ran on. So we've kind of, you know, floated that full spectrum of the call since it's been in service since Saturday. So it's been a busy truck already. As we mentioned, the truck was put into service Saturday with a pushback ceremony, a long-standing tradition in the fire service where the truck is pushed into the station by the firefighters.